Good morning. Welcome to 49ers in 5, your daily update on everything happening with the team that you need to know. I'm Rob Stats Guerrera. Today is Monday, July 29th, 2024. Here's what's happening with your San Francisco 49ers. The injury bug has already struck in 2024. Spencer Burford broke his hand. He may need surgery. He's going to miss at least two to three weeks. So that obviously opens the door for Dominic Pooney, third round pick. Here was Chris Forrester on Friday talking about what makes Pooney special. He's a strong, big body. He just has a lot. Of, you know, he's no bigger than most of them, but he's he's a he's a he's a very He'll set the pocket real well. Um, he plays with great anchor. Uh, he's extremely intelligent. Um, he, he's he's really really a good player, man. He's he's a special guy, and and he's just not done the, the position for very long. And with our system, it's a little bit of a change for him. So there's a, there's going to be a learning curve. But he's got some some real stuff to him. Where a lot of our guards in our system may tend to be quicker. That's where Banks is a great advantage. He is uh, those bigger guys inside do help. And keep in mind, everybody, we all know John Feliciano was the starting right guard by the end of the season, so this may not be a massive injury for the 49ers, but it does make it that much easier for Dominic Pooney to impress the coaches and possibly crack the starting lineup. More injury news now. Talanoa Hufanga could make his practice debut in mid-August when the Niners link up with the joint practices with the Saints, that's obviously good because he said he wanted to come back in week one, so hopefully he can get back a little bit earlier than that. That would obviously be good for the defense. Jacob Cowing is dealing with a hamstring injury. That makes him the third 49ers rookie to have a hamstring problem. Cowing, Isaac Arendo, and Ricky Pearsall. Speaking of Pearsall, Kyle Shanahan said last week he could make his return to practice today that would obviously be very exciting for 49ers fans we always give you one thing to read one thing to watch and one thing you might have missed one thing to read on this monday the interview that brock purdy gave to mike silver let's just say brock is not lacking for confidence in 2024 this is not aw shucks brock this is the brock we see on the field i want to dominate and I am coming at you with that expectation. I highly, highly, highly suggest you click the link in the description of this episode to read the interview. One thing to watch, the pads come on today, baby. The second block of training camp begins and that's when it starts to get interesting. Our own Steph Sanchez is going to be there. She will have a full practice report on YouTube after it's over to let you know everything that went on. Oh, baby, we're getting close. One thing you may have missed, if you like grumpy Kyle Shanahan, guess what? You're going to be seeing him a lot this year because the NFL is instituting a rule change this season. They have a new policy. I guess it's more accurate to say policy. is going into effect, and Kyle's going to hate it. All clubs are now required to make the head coach available live for an interview during the game. Each team has to provide their head coach, one in the first half, one in the second half, and that's for every team, and it's available for all TV partners. I cannot think of something Kyle Shanahan would want to do less during a game than talk with the media, but he is going to have to do that this season. Have a feeling that might get a little interesting. That's a wrap on today's 49ers and 5. Please rate, review, and follow the Gold Standard Podcast Network wherever you get your audio podcasts. Also, like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click the bell to get notified every single time we go live, which is at least every single weekday for you. I will be live with Vish Kumar in 5 p.m. Pacific time tonight. I'm going to talk a lot about that Brock Purdy interview. Enjoy your Monday, everybody. I'm Rob Stats Guerrera. We'll talk later today.